In addition to its visual appeal, the advantage of Linario panels is that the installation process is easy. The panels are installed with adhesive and it is recommended to use Vox mounting adhesive. Apply adhesive to the panel in an eye shape in the form of two strips. In the case of finishing trims, one strip will suffice. In order to use less adhesive and prevent it from overflowing, we recommend cutting off the tip of the adhesive tube. Panels should be installed from left to right and from bottom to top. Linario panels are lightweight and very easy to work with. They can be cut with a hand saw, jigsaw or table saw. Panels and trims should be cut from the B side, in other words, from the non-decorative side. In case of installation with finishing trims, the installation begins with measuring and appropriately cutting the left L trim. In the upper and lower part of the left trim, an appropriate height of universal U trims has to be cut. Then the left trim should be installed on the wall. In the next step, measure and install a universal U trim on the floor. When cutting the U trim, take into account the width of the left and right trims. After installing the left trim and the universal U trim, proceed to installing the panels, remembering to measure the inside distance between the lower and upper U trim. After attaching the first panel, check the horizontal and vertical alignment and install the panel, then attach the next one. Before fastening the panel permanently, you need to make sure there is no gap between the panels and check their vertical horizontal alignment again. The side of the wall is finished with a right R trim. To finish the outside corner, start by installing a universal U-trim near the floor, which should be cut at a 45 degree angle. If you also want to finish the top of the wall with a U-trim, cut it in the same way and install it near the ceiling. Start installing the panels from the corner, moving to the left and right side of the wall. It is important to turn the panels 180 degrees, so they join together with the shorter lock at the corner. Simply interlock the panels at a 90 degree angle, carefully join them and stick them to the wall. It is important to note that this step will not cause a pattern inconsistency and the corner finish will be aesthetically pleasing. When it comes to the inside corner, it can be done in several ways. You can use the right trim, Rotate the panels and connect them with the longer lock. Or maintain the installation continuity. Depending on the chosen option for doing the corner, the wall can be finished using a left L trim or a right R trim. Detailed installation instructions are available at vox.pl.